last and a half guard sequence. So, this time he keeps my leg really tight to the ground. He keeps my knee on the ground with a lockdown. So I'm inside of his half guard, and he threads my leg by bringing his outside leg over and then his inside leg under his, uh, uh, over his foot and under my foot. And now he's keeping my knee on the ground. So it takes away my ability to do numbers one through six. So I go into number seven. All right. So from here, you know, I'm starting off just like number one, but I'm going to dive. I'm going to go all the way to his hip. My head is going to go to his hip on the outside. And my elbow is going to capture his hip on the inside. Just like this. Here. Capture him tight. My hands are going to gable grip underneath his butt. And I'm going to slowly mule kick my way out of this position. Alright? And I guess a mule kick isn't... isn't uh, the best way to word it because it's not necessarily a kick more constant pressure and not against his calf but against his feet because his feet are what is trapping my leg so I dive my head I gable grip under his butt pinching my elbows and I create pressure against his feet from here the inside leg punches his knee I go to a cross mount position. All right, again. So now he threads, locking my leg down against the mat. From here, it's going to take away moves numbers one through six, so I go to number seven. I dive my head, I pinch my elbow, it's tied against the hip, and it's not the crown of my head, but my forehead that's on the mat. So it takes away possibilities for guillotine chokes. I'm pinching this elbow because I don't want to get my arm trapped in that kimura. Here. I grab onto my hand with a gable grip and I put pressure. Capture the knee. And it's really tight that I capture the knee. You can even come underneath his legs here for a real tight grip as you work yourself into a cross mount position. And finish with the cross mount. All right, so that's move number seven in our passing the half guard sequence. Thank you for uh, visiting.